yes, definitely yes. You got the Tomb Raider feeling in this temple. Hi, we are Sara and Igor, two travel enthusiasts who take every opportunity to discover the most beautiful corners of the world. We quit our jobs and sold everything we had to fulfill our biggest dream, to travel the world full time. In Cambodia, we made our first stop in Siem Reap to explore fascinating temples like Angkor Wat, the Tomb Raider Temple and more. We are visiting the Tat Krom Temple, but everyone here calls it the Tomb Raider Temple because they used actually this temple to film some scenes from Tomb Raider with Angelina Jolie as Lara Croft. We are huge movie freaks and we already watched so many movies together but what is one of our most favorite things is to watch movies from locations where we already have been or where we are at the moment so guess which movie are we going to watch next Only few steps more. <laughs> Whoa. the tempo is already there wow but where is the tree around the temple. Did they took the tree out? I hope no. Wow, you can see the temple destroyed by the tree. I think those temples, what I heard about the internet, <laughs> read it, and those temples were left after the people moved out from here and then the jungle took over and it completely destroyed the temples they of course restored it a little bit but it still looks really natural and beautiful wow found a dream <laughs> sarah croft you can also see how powerful the tree is so it found its way through the stones yes Definitely yes, you got the Tomb Raider feeling in this temple. It is so amazing to see this place once with your own eyes, to be here, to see all the trees, all the wildness. I think this could be also my favorite temple. You can just imagine how old are those temples by the size of the trees growing from the temple. This is crazy. I'm picking some information from all the tour guides which are walking here around with their customers and here is also like the so-called Tomb Raider tree and the guy said also that in the movie it looks a little bit different because of course with some CGI they made it how they want it. Hello. Thank you. I think, uh, Thank you. Visiting Cambodian temples, day number two. We are starting our day with Prekan Temple. And the names here in Cambodia are pretty tricky because even if you got the letter H in the word, you are not always pronouncing it. The day is looking amazing. The weather is great. And we are pretty excited to see the temple. Almost in each room outside the window you see like those stones which are probably coming from the damaged parts of the temple. What I don't really understand are these kind of shrines which are like in the middle of the pathway so why are they right here and to pass them is also not so easy so I don't know exactly how it worked like 800 years ago. Also in this temple you can find some beautiful engravings. And I think this one so far is my favorite. It is absolutely stunning. I just said, Sarah, we have to move on because you can't see everything. You can't explore each corner. But then you walk like just a little bit further and you see some other places where you are super happy that you didn't miss them. It's really hard and we are spending like hours in each temple. On the way to our next temple, which is called Neak Peon, we have to go a different path compared to the other places because there you had like everything full with stone or also like wild nature in the middle of the jungle and here you are on a bridge 
over a lake and you have even some beautiful water lilies which are following you through the whole way to the temple. This place was once used as a national hospital and of course it was different kind of medicine as we know nowadays. So they took some leaves and plants, put it in the mouth, chewed it and then they spit it out and put it like on the skin to heal you. I see the tree, but I don't see the face. We are at Tasson Tempa and we were expecting something a little bit different. We were thinking there will be a Buddha face and all around it it's going to be a tree. But this is a temple and around you got a tree. But it is still really beautiful. At the Isme Bon Temple you have like in four corners elephants looking in the four different cardinal directions. When you're visiting CM Rep, everyone who wants to sell you a tour, they will talk about the small tour and the big tour. And to let you understand what they really mean with that is the small tour was like the three main temples and the big tour is with the temples we are visiting today. So in our opinion you will need at least two days to enjoy everything, to not just be in a rush going from one temple to another. So at least plan two days to visit the most important temples here in Simrep. This is the last temple for today. It is called Pre Rope and it's really huge. This time we are not going inside because we already seen so many temples. But for tomorrow morning we've got something special planned. Good morning guys, today we woke up at 4 o'clock because we had something really special on our bucket list. We wanted to see the Angkor Wat temple during the sunrise. So our tuk-tuk driver arrived at about 5 o'clock and once we arrived here it was still dark and we wouldn't believe how many people already were here if we wouldn't see it with our own eyes. It were at least hundred maybe even more people because everyone wanted to experience this beautiful view once in their life and it is incredible once you are here and if you have more than one day make sure to come here and enjoy this really really special moment this is a bucket list thing to do i had to wake up at four o'clock in the morning but it was totally worth it it is absolutely beautiful got all the people around here but once you are here, you definitely have to wake up in the morning and come to see it. This is it guys, we had such a wonderful time here in Siem Reap and Angkor Wat but because we woke up so early today in the morning we now definitely need some sleep but if you liked it as we did please don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe and see you in our next video. Bye bye! From the location we are currently traveling. Yeah. Lily flowers, that's the name, right? Water lilies. Water lilies. You have to cross a bridge, you are well. They filmed here the Tomb Raider movie when Lara was in her best age. You are not posting this on YouTube. <laughs>